Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'll, I'll go along with that because I've got a duty. I've got a duty to do. That's it. Yes. Yes. You have to do it yeah. Because only you can can write down. Yeah. The uh, laws to issue those documents. Yeah. Th no, that's correct because uh, we're going back on to the um, <coughs> 1830 to 1837 King Williams Acts of Westminster Parliament, and we're yes. going back to uh, um, King George's Acts of Parliament. Connected, yes. connected to that, and we're going back to King William the Third, Acts of Parliament that created the Bank of England and the Pound Note. And King William. Those certificates and those warrants. Yeah. We can then say that the Bank of England and the Pound Note that you've Yeah. Can't be yeah. So if you if you arrange the hui for that as soon yes. as soon as possible before the 29th, then I'll go along with that. If you put it all together, because you you might have the resources and the time and the people to do it, then you'll have to organise the whole administration. I'm just telling you right now. And Bundy will, will do his part in, in the court procedures, but then you'll have to, I'm just saying that, uh, 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 loud out now, that you'll have to do the administrative part of uh, uh, the upper house political side, and I'll keep you on track on that. Yeah, so I've got all the documents here to cover all that from that Manukau perspective, but it belongs to everybody. And Moai's, Moai Crown is for everybody. We use the Moai Crown because it's a memorial that has been commercialised by Queen Victoria in 1868. She took it, the first one, to England. The Dutch didn't touch it. She took it to England and made it commercial. That's why we are commercial under that brand name. Oh, you can do whatever you like now. You Thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much for that. Uh, I appreciate that because um, it's a pity I wasn't there to witness everything that was going on. I used your name in the prayers. That's good. Uh, uh, thank you for that. <coughs> I accept everything you're saying because there's no way out. There's nowhere to go. This is the way. Yes. There's only well, one. Now that we've got it, yeah. I feel very comfortable and safe. And you can start now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So what needed now is is a formal letter from you with with that establishment, so yes. that I can put it in my psyche as being an authority from this country, huh? over this country. Huh? That has to be put in place before the court hearing on the twenty ninth of next and month. We're referring to the twenty ninth of September. Yeah, September. That's the court hearing in Auckland, a two-hour case, precedent case for this country and the whole rest of the world. So if we can say speakers and comfortably around, say, the 11th of September, yeah. we will be doing and creating magic. That's right. That's your job. I'm no. just making the statement now. That's your job to administer the business no. of the Whakaminiya. Uh, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> I have to be anyway. The, the surrogate sits in, in all, all political matters. That'll be wonderful. Well, may I commend you for all your hard work. Mm -hmm. And even although at times you must have thought, now, what the heck have I been given? Mm. I have to tell you, that's my same thoughts as I was construing and constructing this yeah. But now that it's both a reality, your journey into the, uh, the King's Bench Court mm -hmm. and our journey into the Upper House, yeah. we now have both houses complete. That's right. And That's... I can, my congratulations to you, dear cousin. Thank you. And may you always have a wonderful life and please look after yourself. That's what I'm going to do. That's why my nurse has come to check up to make sure I'm in top condition. Okay. Well, thank you for those blessings and thank you for the for the talk. I will always keep you abreast of what's going on. Okay, that's good. Bye bye now. Bye. Have a nice day. Bye. <coughs> well, that's Te Porahu. I've got the 
a small camera on now because my other camera, I think something went wrong with it and it's run out of battery, I think. I've got the GoPro on now. I'm just saying that I'm um, talking to uh, Te Poroho, uh Ruka. Uh, he's in charge of the Whakaminia Upper House and that's the political side of our organisation administration of things that are native or whatever name he wants to call it, Maori or, or anything else, but I'm saying there's a clear divide on who we are as apart from the Crown Corporation's Maori iwi organisations that are on the Queen's side, we're going on the King's side of the ledger with this flag, uh, straight to Britain as magistrate court in the native um, Marais. <clears throat> and so I want to make this public notice uh, to everybody that although we had our differences with um, each other, Maoris, uh, we're suddenly coming together. And I'm fortunate that I wasn't up at uh, Te Hapua and Spirit Spain saw the Karakias going together, but it's in my heart um, that I'm there, but I'm busy here in a one band show. Uh, one man band show, but that won't be there any longer. It won't be me, it would be we, <coughs> because there's no way anyone could fathom all this lot with uh, what I've just told you or told him on the video as cited fact evidence that this flag has more than just its looks. It has a history of <coughs> British connection to contracts that were set by the king and will be continuing with the king, our king, and our jurisdiction to exercise our right to use its power and the Westminster government power as their partners in business um, under this flag. So um, thank you Te um, uh, and your Japanese wife uh, for being so kind as to accommodate me in your prayers and in your um, organisation there because I'm running another organisation, the Maui Crown King William IV Trust. <clears throat> the political and um, financial arm of our organisation around the world with this flag. I've taken the flag right through the world uh, from what it is in Waitangi as being a national flag it's more than a national flag, it's an international flag of a king. The only king's flag in the world that we have not used because no one could understand it. Only very few of us could understand it. And they have died. All those chiefs have died. Paramount chiefs and all have died, taking the information with it and with them. But lucky, I've got as much as I could get from them before they went. And it's our time now to put it all together. <clears throat> so, um, um, I just do my um, uh, some more of the video later uh, because I've got to go and pick the stamps up of uh, Hongiheka and Kirawakato Wharehirehiru Manukau that goes on our documents, our legal documents, and <coughs> Te Porohau's upper house legal documents. It goes on there at the same time to authenticate. Um, their documents from our origins through the Magistrate Court and we have our own Native Magistrate Court in the Marais, any Marae in this country and any court in the world um, where the Queen's Bench Court is, the King's Bench Court sits opposite. It's still there live. It's still there. This flag is live in those courts. <coughs> so um, um, now that Te Poroho's called me and Bundy Waitai, the Paramount Chief, and uh, Manahi um, Parapara Mohini, the other Paramount Chief, has texted me. Now we are talking, uh, talking business, and talking commercial and also spiritual and physical, uh, all at the same time. In the law of Tikanga, the law of Maui Crown and Maui, Spirit, <coughs> Earth Well Creator, um, our Atua, and also um, the, the today, where, where to from here, and what we do to apply our power 
and um, this will be set up before the 29th of September 2017 in the court hearing in Auckland that I'm setting up. So I'm just making <coughs> factual information of what's just been put together and the National um, um, Geographic was there at uh, Te Hapua and Spirits Bay, Te Reringa Wairua, they were filming the whole thing and so that's more or less got a public perception on what we are all about and who we are and what's been hidden from us or you hidden is all this what I'm saying about these two chiefs that are on our stamp and uh, Kendall Thomas Kendall um, Bishop Thomas Kendall and also King William the <coughs> fourth and the flag and this flag on that stamp straight on the document that's our legacy of just what I told you and told to put a, a lot of information in a short space of time rattling off my tongue. It's all there, it's all here, and we're going to make it formal, legal, and binding on the Queen's Crown and other crowns uh, of the Rothschilds and other people that have got their own crowns. We have our own crown, God's crown, my word against your crown and also cited evidence, fact, information that's derived all the king's wealth in the world and his trust, the Moai Crown King William IV Trust, is the inheritor of the Queen's Bench Court Trust and all the other trusts that have used this flag and the admiralty of the kings inside this flag right to derive all the wealth and all its prized possessions and lands and properties and people into the crown's ownership we are the crown that's what i'm saying we are the crown the maui crown is real okay so that's all on this video it's today's uh, tuesday the 22nd of August 2017 and I'm just going to pick the stamps up now and um, off to the gym after that. My nurse has just did my readings um, she says it's 160 over 90 and um, um, pulse of I think it was 61 61 was pulse pulse 61 so that's not too bad she says it's still high it should be 140 over 75 or 80 but hey i can live with that that's without medications by the way the medications will bring it down but i'm trying other means i'm trying this this stuff here so this stuff she's just scanned it and it's got too much sugar in it so i have to change all that and this one spirulina that's right they've got sugar in it mostly sugar so that's really the end of that Anyway, that's all I want to say for now, because I better get along and go and get these stamps. Okay, bye for now. See you later.